Hi Challengers, welcome to Core Day. Today's workout is truly my favorite. It's all about strengthening those muscles in the center of the body that are truly the powerhouse of the body. They're essential for having great posture. So really focus and enjoy your workout today. This is your intermediate warm-up workout. I'm here with Ashley and AJ, my workout partners. Let's get going with a plank walkout. Squat down to the floor, walk out your hands, hold in plank position, and then just walk it back. This is a great warm-up move for warming up your entire body, especially your wrists and your shoulders. Walk it out and hold, and then come back. You should feel the stretch in your shoulders, feel your core activating. One more time. Our next warm-up move is a reverse lunge, hands on the hips. We're gonna, as we step back, arms come up and back to the middle, alternating sides. This is great, stretching out the shoulders, getting your legs ready for your workout ahead. Keep it going. One more on each side. And now let's warm up the hips, just one side at a time with a knee lift. Tap back, knee lift. Nice athletic move, add in the arms. One more and then let's switch sides, tap back and up we come. Driving that knee, high knee position. You'll really feel this stretching out your hamstrings, your quads. Okay, let's get our heart rate up with some simple half jumping jacks, just half way up with the arms. Legs are out to the side, let's get that blood flowing. This is great, starting out nice and easy. Our second time through, we're gonna pick up the pace. Keeping with cardio, we're gonna move on to a little jog. So we're gonna just jog a few paces forward and a few paces back, forward and back. So this is great, warming up the ankles, getting your heart rate up. One more time forward. Now we're gonna go through that again, a little more athletic this time, reaching the arms up, hands come down, walk it out. One arm up, other arm up, and back you go. Really reaching up, stretching the core, activating the core, stretching the shoulders. Let's make it one more time. Reach, reach back up to standing. A little more athletic with our leg swings, tapping back this time, straight leg, and reach for the toe. Really warming up the hamstrings. The bigger the movement, the more calories you're burning. Switch legs. Two more times. This time, full jumping jacks, arms all the way up overhead. When you're warming up, it's perfect. Start out slow and then make those moves more dynamic as you go. Keep it going. Now this time, instead of jogging forward, let's work on agility, jogging to the side and the other side. Jog and go. Lift that knee. Nice and athletic. Keep it going. Three, two, one. Great job. Your intermediate warm up is over. 
This is a five minute core workout that's gonna work every single muscle in that core complex. I'm here with Ashley and AJ. Let's get going with a standing oblique crunch. One leg is out to the side, arms come up overhead. We're gonna lift one leg and crunch. Crunch to the middle, working on your balance here and really challenging the obliques. If you're a beginner, just follow Ashley. She's tapping that foot down to the floor. And then when you're ready to try really challenging your balance, you can just go ahead and lift that knee. Let's do three more. Three, two, one. Switch sides. Over you go. Lift the leg, crunch to the center. Remembering to breathe whenever you're doing a core workout. Focus on breathing. Inhale on the way out, exhale when you lift the knee. Two more, one, two. Let's take it down to the floor for our plank crunch. Getting into a plank position, wrists directly beneath the shoulders, lifting up that one arm and one leg, and then just go ahead and crunch to the middle, extend. Crunch to the middle, extend out. In and out. Working on your balance. Now, if you're a beginner, it's okay to follow Ashley. See how she's keeping one knee on the floor and she's being conscious of keeping her eyes looking just in front so that she's really taking care of her spine. Keep it going. Now go ahead, get back into plank. Lift the opposite arm up this time and opposite leg. And here we go with the crunch. Out and in, out and in. This really challenges your entire body. Your glutes are working, your core is working. Really working cross body with the obliques. One more. Great job. Let's take it all the way down to the floor. Whenever you work your core, it's important that you turn over and work the back. Extend the arms out front. And this is our Superman pose. So go ahead, take a deep breath, lift arms and legs up off the floor, hold, and lower. Second time through, lift up, extend the arms, extend the legs, and back down. To the front, and down. To the side, and down. This exercise is great. It works the, the muscles in your lower back. If you're a beginner, what you wanna do is go ahead and keep your arms to the side and don't lift as high, but you're really still working these great lower back muscles. Give me two more. And now go ahead and come into a seated position. It's one of my favorite moves, really gonna challenge your core. We call them boat tuck. So both legs are up, arms are out, tuck in, and extend back out, tuck in, and extend out. If you're a beginner, it's okay, follow Ashley, keep those hands on the floor, in and out, control the core, point the toes. You'll really feel these work in those six pack muscles. Four more, four, three, two, give me one more. Let's go to our final move. For this, we're gonna get into beast position here. So that's up on your toes, hands are down. And all you're gonna do is bring your leg through, lift the arm up, come back to the middle. Leg through, arm up, back to the middle. While you're doing this, make sure your eyes are following your foot. And you're pivoting through. Kicking it forward. Really challenging the core. Kick through, lift that arm up. Three more. Two. And one. Great job. That was your five minutes of core. 
By now, you've worked your rectus abdominal muscles, which are your six-pack muscles. You've worked the muscles at the side, your obliques, and the ones that help you keep a flat tummy, your transverse abdominals, just got a great workout. Great job.